half heading into the locker room, this hits it right there. Take that momentum, take that good feeling, and take it to the locker room, regroup, and start over. They got it here. They did indeed. A lot of football, full half to be played. And that'll carry over the back line of the end zone for a touchback. The Panthers offense here, they get ready to head back on the field. And with time quickly fading here in the second quarter, not sure how aggressively, offensively they want to play this. I think we'll find out just how much they trust their guys in this situation if they decide to take a shot. They go play action here on first down. Being chased out left. And he'll be hit as he releases it. And that'll fall incomplete. Curtis Samuel, the intended target. And that'll bring up second down. Play action supposed to be used to slow down pressure, slow down blitzes. In this case, though, if it takes a little too long to develop, you got people right in your face. And lucky just to get rid of the ball with the arm going forward. Could have been a fumble. Now it's Newton. He's going to sling this deep downfield into heavy traffic, and it's intercepted. It's Desmond Trufant. Ball up to the 35 now as they come up on first and 10. And this offense going to elect to burn a timeout with five seconds remaining in quarter number two. So even though it's first down, here's the field goal unit on now to try to get three before halftime. From the left hash, this will be a 52-yard attempt. And Bryant's kick is good. And they'll cut the lead back down to four now at 14-10. So they're still down, but they are able to salvage three here heading into the lockers. This is what you work on from the beginning of training camp. Heading into the half, put some points on the board. No matter what the score says at that point, you've accomplished what you set out to do. Here's Bosher to kick it away. Short, short kick. One of the up middle take it now. So we've hit intermission. It's halftime. This is the NFL, and it's a presentation of EA Sports. All right, Coach, thank you, and we welcome everyone back for quarter number three. Both teams appear ready for the fight ahead, and we resume action here in quarter number three. This will be fielded on the back line of the end zone. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. And here now come the Falcons. They're close, close game, but they're going to need to do a little bit better probably here in half two, no? I would agree with that totally. I would guess it in the locker room. They talked about cleaning up some of the errors, but overall, I think they wanted to be positive with them. Guys, we're right there. Just not playing as well as we need to. Let's pick it up, and we still have a chance to win this game. Yeah, they do. We'll see if they can pick it up. Here's second and seven now from the 28. Freeman again. And he'll get about four across the 30 to the 32. On any running play this call, they're always hoping that it's going to break big and go the distance. But when you get a nice game like that, you're able to do so many things anyway. You can come back and run essentially the same play again, continue to move the ball on the ground, or you can decide to throw the ball now because usually you have the defense back on its heels. Third down, it's Freeman. And able to get this one across the 45 before he's brought down. And a nice carry there of 15 yards. Well, after an interception, last thing you want to do is go three and out, give the ball right back. They avoided that. Yeah, you definitely do not want to do that. I remember in college, I played with a really big-time player on defense. We ended up getting an interception as we passed the offense coming out. He told him, if you don't take care of this football, you have to answer to me later. You definitely want to take care of it, pick up first downs. A loss of a full three yards, and now it's second down. Now Ryan on second down. Here's Sanu on the catch. And he'll be brought down at the 45-yard line. So they get 11 back on that one. It leads to third down. I always laugh when people say, what's the toughest route to defend? And I'm like, any of them, especially if it's a good receiver. 
that makes things very difficult. But when you're running a drag route, something Here's short, out. shallow, going through defenders, using guys almost as, as screens in order to get Back open, out. that makes things tougher, guys trying to get to the football. Third and two, now Ryan. He's got Sanu. And he's taken down inside the 30. It'll be a gain of 16 and give him a first down as well. A little football 101 there. You just see the receiver try to run down the defender, meaning he goes right at him and really trying to move him a little bit towards the center of the field so he can put his foot in the ground and break to the out to the sideline and make a catch. Back to the running game. It's Freeman. And he went nowhere. He'll lose yardage back to the 29. That's going to go as a loss of a yard, and it'll be second down. It's real easy to say this running game needs to be better, but the reality is they've been given little time to actually find a place to run the football. It's almost like the defense is there on the handoff. On second down, Ryan. And incomplete there. A nice hit. Jars the ball free and brings up third down. Going with a dime look on defense. Two extra defensive backs on the field and covered up essentially every blade of grass. That allowed them to disrupt the play. The Falcons on third down. They've been good. Three for four thus far. This is third and 11. Here's Ryan to throw. Giving it out left side to Sanu. They'll get 10 there, but it leaves them just short for fourth down. Now that's going to be a tough one to explain when they get together and watch the game film, isn't it? I mean, they had the right call, had the out route. He's got to know where the first down sticks are, yet he steps out of bounds that close. Not their best play. And no signs of the field goal unit. They're going for it on fourth down. They'll run it. Freeman. Devontae Freeman is shifting. This doesn't pay off here in short yardage. And the Panthers will get the football back. So he needed the short yard as Charles he elected to try to bounce it outside of the outer third unsuccessful. Sometimes those plays are stacked up by the defense and there's nowhere to go so you have to bounce it outside.